This is a short demonstration of how to skim cream. You can see here that I have my gallon jug of milk, which is how I get my raw milk from the farm. The only tools you really need for this in my homemade version is a turkey baster and a, I store my cream in, in uh, glass jars. Mason jars uh, work really well. And so what I want you to see here is just how you can see where the cream line is. You can see right about here there's a line where the cream has risen to the top and separated from the milk. Now unless you use a commercial separator you're not going to get all of the cream out of the milk which is fine. We like to have a little bit left in for flavor. So the line's about right here and that's where we're going to skim down to. So I'll show you how that looks from the top as we do that. Skimming the cream by just taking the turkey baster, squeezing it in and I just hold it right along the top and skim it around the edges. I move it around as I do so it doesn't get it all from one place. Once it's full, I just squirt that into the into the glass jar. I'm going to keep doing this. I have about an inch and a half of cream here on the top. So I'm going to keep doing this until I get down close to the, the layer where the milk meets the cream. And I'll know that I'm there because the, the milk will have sort of a bluish tinge to it in contrast to the cream, and it's a lot thinner, so you'll start to see that sort of swirling in. You will get a little bit of milk in with your cream doing it this way, but I have found that it works just fine for any of the things I do with cream like butter making or sour cream or any of those things. And you'll see too that it really doesn't take very long to get the cream off. I get about five gallons that I use for milk a week uh, and out of that I might get hmm, Close to, close to two quarts of cream, so it uh, does pretty well for most of our needs here. Now, I'm going to try and zoom in here a little bit so that you can see how we're starting to get some of the milk tinge coming in. We'll So you can see that out of this one gallon of milk I got almost half a quart of cream and that's all there is to it. I'm now going to finish skimming the other gallons that I have and then we can see what to do with the cream.